He's a baby then, not anymore. Careful driving. Who's up there? I don't know one of those little. One of those little whipper snappers? Yeah. Oh, it's 5.30? Holy baloney. I didn't know that. Well, 5.29. Well. I'm running. Hi, you happy time. people. I'm still basking in the glow of winning my printer. light. Hi guys. Backer, backer, and everybody I missed. <coughs> Wednesday, isn't it? Yep. Okay. My nose is red up and out the side. Here. It's cold. And windy. And windy. 
And we're all complaining. No, why, we're not. Why, why? Yeah, we're whining, but we're not complaining. This is mad. I have to remember what I ordered. That's what was really like. I thought maybe you got another case of ping pong balls. Oh. What am I doing? Okay. I think the mine is frozen, or the quote is frozen in my mind. Boing, boing, baby, oh, we do. See our Christmas tree? Oh, Christmas tree. There it is. Now, I know somebody might say, well, you decorated it more last year. <coughs> and that would be true. But, um, Annabelle, right there she is has figured out when she goes up there on the purple walk, if she reaches over, she can tap all that stuff oh. up there. So, <laughs> it's not safe. Yeah, hey Miss, you can take all of our cold. You, you guys are probably colder than us, aren't you Mish? Well, Elsie didn't try to get it, but um, uh, Annabelle certainly did. Let's see if we can change that thingamajigger. So, oops, that's not what I wanted. Oh, oh there we go. Phew. Thank you, Dark Gat. Spiker. Well, he might be. Fall out. Get your butt out here. He's sleeping, but he'll be out. Yeah. Yeah, Miss, you're probably colder than us, I'll bet. But we just checked the weather. It's the weirdest thing because as cold as it is now, on, um, <coughs> what day was that that we were staying over there, Pat? It's 16 right now. It feels like 3. So that's pretty not that bad. But um, we're supposed to get less than an inch of snow tonight. Tomorrow, the low is 2. No, the low is 4. High is 11. Saturday, we that was when it was predicted we would get some snow. But the low is 24 and the high is 40. So now we're going to have a heat wave. And then we'll send that up to you, Mish. No, I will melt all the slop and then it'll <laughs> plunge down to zero again. <laughs> Yeah, Monday the high, the low is going to be zero. Yeah, but sunshiny. It says but sunshiny, so that's good. Yeah. Yeah, it's winter. What can we say? Yeah. So, other than burr, I had to. Put, I wore a heavier shirt today, and still had to put a vest on. So we spent some of our morning um, weighing the, all the kitties and uh, trimming nails. Got a new cat in. I'll tell you about that in a, and after we get done. Maybe maybe I can bring her out just to show you real quick. Um, but we're what? A week and a half from Christmas? Can you believe it? Wait a minute. That, that is right. I know it goes too fast. This is from Faithy, our volunteer. Oh man, your Rachel is going to be so happy. There's two bar, two bags of the uh, CET Chewy, and this this ranks up there just like chicken. Yeah, just like chicken. Alice, Mary, let me remember. And Faithy, thank you. Tomorrow morning, I'll have some fun passing that around. Uh, Anna, or uh, Alice Mary, I think it was a gain of two. Uh, no, she stayed even, Stephen. November 14th, she was 309. Then December 7th, she was 307. And today, she's still 307. I was a little disappointed in that. I, I thought she would have done a little more, but because she, 
She feels hey, solider when you pick her up. Phoebe gained three ounces. She's 5'05". She's still pretty small, but um, at least she's going in the right direction, right? We're still freezing. <laughs> I don't think it does make much difference, Mish. <laughs> When you gotta put on layers, it's all cold. Yeah. I know it. I was hoping it would. She would. She's eating a little bit better today. But tomorrow's her big day. Donna and Larry, bless her heart. They're gonna come tomorrow about. Uh, I think 10:30ish, and they're gonna pick up um, Alice Mary. She's going to the vet. I I just have to. I mean, we could keep plugging along like this, but I just have a funny feeling something isn't quite right. And so uh, they're going to work on her tomorrow and do some investigations on her. <laughs> yeah, wait them after the ham. Okay, this box is from Amazon, but I don't have a... name on this, Mish? Miranda. Miranda. Miranda sent this. There's two of the seventh generation chlorine free bleach. 64 ounces. Lifts tough stains, non-toxic formula, flea free and clear. No fragrances. If every household in the U.S. replaced just one bottle of a 64-ounce chlorine bleach with our 64-chlorine-free bleach, we could prevent 11.6 million pounds of chlorine from entering our environment. Wow. Well, we're going to do two of them then because we have two. Yeah, Mish, there's two of these. Thank you, Miranda. We'll read directions and get the right um, measurement for what we do. Yeah, thank you. This is very, very kind. I like being good to the environment. And we have a, a little envelope, package envelope, and we have one box, and then we have a whole bunch of envelopes, because I did not get to open envelopes on Monday night. We were busy. We were busy, yeah. This is from my great friend, Dark Cat. Thank you, Dark Cat. Pat, thank you for opening the boxes for me. I'm not sure about the front there. Okay. Oh. Oh. Hey, this one can go on our Christmas tree, Dark Cat. Isn't that cute? Look at the fish. Oh. I'm going to put this on this tree, Dark Cat. Thank you. Appreciate it. And he's smiling. He says, I got my tuna. Yeah. Oh, Barb, did you hit your head on the tree? No, the ma. Oh, the ma. Oh, yeah. That's going to happen. Yeah, oh, it'll... Maybe that breakable one needs a bonfire. Which one? This one? Yeah. When did John London see it? Someone loved it. Someone? Wait, I had it twice since I got here, so... I'll stick it 
And this is from my good friend Sean. Sean lives in Georgia, and he might be on. He's happy playing. And hey, Terry, 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 that might that'll fall off. And um, Sean is a, an official long distance uh, volunteer for the rescue center. He helps me in several different ways. And I always appreciate Sean. And Sean's been here, what is it, Sean, two times, I think, with your family. And Sean also adopted Merritt from us. And he's a very good friend. And he says, can open on cam. Oh, and i got to tell you about that, too. Oh. Oh. Oh my gosh, Sean, this is gorgeous. Oh my gosh, look at that. Sean, this is beautiful. I love this. Isn't that pretty? It's got sparkles on this side, bling bling, and then on the back it doesn't. Thank you, Sean. I really like that very much. And we got a package here to Jackie from Sean. I got to tell you something funny then, Sean. Terry, what are you doing, you little rascal? Sean, you are cool. I'll get Steve to put some batteries in there for me. Sean and I, Sean loves cars and vehicles. And I think, if I remember right, Sean, this is a replica of a vehicle that you did a video on for me, I think. I'm pretty sure. And uh, any time that I'm in a different vehicle that is kind of cool, I take uh, pictures. Oh, this is going. This is going to be a fun car. I take pictures of the dashboard and then send it to Sean. That's why when um, the uh, spay neuter big truck came, I took pictures of that for Sean and the fire engine that came. Some guy had a. Uh, what was that? A Ferrari out there a couple weeks ago, and I and I said, no. "Can I climb in and take a picture of your dash?" He said, "Sure." <laughs> so I did that for Sean too. But um, yeah, thank you, Sean. I appreciate that. And the funny thing is, is my package to you went out today. So I got yours today, and your package went out today. So look for it, Sean. Yeah, thank you. He's a good friend. Pippi yeah, it's like his. Yeah. Pippi first. Pippi is such but a great cat. Um, I got some cool news for you. A lot of you folks have been asking me if there's a 2017 FFRC calendar, and I've had to say no that there isn't. And sorry about that noise. And uh, I just got word from. Gus, and she's going to do a calendar for us using Sherry's pictures. So I'm thrilled. I told, wrote back and said, I love, love, love it. Thank you. That, uh, you know, I've had quite a few people asking me about it. So uh, Goss, Goss is on it. So thank you, Goss. And that's going to be wonderful. Appreciate it. Okay. Where, where is Zelda? You know, oh yeah, she's, she lives on that counter, doesn't she? She's just on it all the time. Okay, look at this. This is three days worth of 
um, cards. I think they're cards. Must be Christmas. Time to open up cards. Hey, Pat. Maybe we could put um, put them on the door and the window. Okay. Okay. Um, I'll get some tape. Okay. Thank you. I always like having having uh, Pat help us. There was one other box, and I'm. It was uh. It's a big box, and it and I, Pat, you and I were supposed to remember that we both Sparkle. flunked. We flunked. No, oh. you remembered. Oh. Uh -uh. No, OJ says, wasn't there another box? Um, there. It's a case of. Thanks, LJ. Twenty-four, is it? It's a giant case, anyway. Yeah, Tw twenty-four rolls of Sparkle paper towels. And my memory is really bad. Because that, that box is for Tabitha, if I remember right. And I have, I'll have to go back in and remember who sent that. But now that, was I wasn't told, so I, that's no, not my responsibility. No, it's, it's not, it wasn't on the box, but I know this. I think it's Bianca, isn't it? Sends a case of the sparkle paper towels uh, for uh, Tabitha. So thank you. Uh, did you find a surge protector in your dining room? You mean from when you were here before? Oh, not that I remember, Connie. I don't know. Goss, Goss will do it all. She's she, she will have such a great way of arranging it all. Okay, well let's, uh, and LG, is that the box you mean? There's no other box out there, is there? Oh, cool. yeah. oh and that box is meds for, for the rescue center. Okay. Oh, there is a box. Oh, that got one. Yeah. Da da da! Oh, this is trash, yeah. We do have a box, and I think it's from LJ. And it's cold. So and it's cold. It just got here. Thank you, LJ. Okay, thanks, Connie. <laughs> LJ, what did you send us? Ooh, I see this. Oh, oh, we got a letter. Well, this is getting downright silly. I go to the store, doesn't matter which store, and something catches my eye. Oh, FFRC could use that, and look, it's on sale, or whatever. Jump in my carriage, little thing. Come home and join the stuff pile. LJ, you're a nut. Next thing you know, there in the corner of my back room is a bunch of stuff collected over time that needs to get out of that corner. I want my corner back. So you are once again stuck with some stuff. Do with it as you will. LJ always tells me when she comes and she brings things, I said, oh, i got to write it down. She always says, just put stuff. Just put stuff. Oh, man, we love these stuff. These, these are those memory phones. One, two, there's four of them here, Mudgy. These are, these are really nice. I'm always taking my finger and pointing at them. Yeah, the cats love them. We use these for lots of different things. And they wash up just fine. Yeah, thank you, LJ. Um, storage room, and then I'm doing some rearranging um, cupboards tomorrow, and we'll get those out. Oh, look at here. Oh man, these are. Oh, I think they're frozen almost. And what do you know? They're open. What's your favorite color? Careful. What do you think that's warm? It might be frozen. They're very, very cold. Barb, do you want one now? No. I'll stick it in my pocket and warm it up. And beds. Oh gosh. LJ, these are really nice. Look at these. Oh, these 
These are really nice. Oh, and look at here. Well, oh, everything is really cold. Um, spatulas. We use a lot of these because they rip in the cans. Oh, and this is for... This goes to Mary. Let me... My one holding... My one holding cage is getting kind of full. I'll stick it up there. I'll let Mary know that that's in there. Oh, and a can of sardines. Yay. And check out this beautiful blankie. All done? And it's so soft. LJ, I don't know how you keep finding these awfully soft blankies. These are really nice. Ooh. Yeah, that makes me want to cuddle in it. And we have another can of sardines and another can of sardines. LJ, and I think we have enough, um, I was going to say feathers, fur to send you again. And we have another blankie. We'll look at this one. Oh, don't worry. Be happy. Yeah, but it's not, I'm, I usually try not to answer it. Gray boxes. I used to always say just in case my mom, but she calls myself. Well, not very often, though. Did her ex speak that out yet? I have not done that, but I told her about it. Yeah. The thing is, she's got it now. Well, so I don't know whether to confuse her or not. And another blankie. And there's some really cool stuff in here you guys are going to like. Look at this. These are so soft. How do they do this? I don't know. Boy, that's a beautiful one. Mm -hmm. Thanks, LJ. Wow. These are nice to go over the big poofs and to go. That's truck or scratch and cardboard. I bet you Connie's close by. Yeah. Oh dear. Yeah, she did. Um, I'm out of oh. it. We went in a box with candy. Mm -hmm. I say you went in a box with candy. Oh. Yeah, if we get him out of that, Barb, it probably won't be so bad. Let me wipe the little bomb, okay? I can see he's that worse than anything. Poor Crotty. I just wonder what degree of sensation he has. Well, you know he has some because he uses, you know, like that. Uh-huh. Oh. Always say he wanted to wash my hands. Yeah, he's so he's so Did happy. Oh, you see these go by? Okay. Hmm. Oh, it's going oh, hard. The two kids. Oh, isn't it so cute? Leg up. Oh gosh. Okay, you guys ready for the cool stuff here? Um. Do these go to the storeroom? Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Pat. Because I want to see the cool stuff, too. Yeah. Um, oh, she sent some more of those. Yeah. Well, yeah. And, you know, LJ, I can't, I think sometimes you can't do them any bigger or better, and yet you do. This is called So Happy. This, oh, gosh, I love this. This is Walter's fur. Oh. Is Gosh, that is awesome with the black frame inside and the white. Oh, gosh. So charming. Isn't that beautiful? That is Walter's fur. This one is called Buddies. Oh, my gosh. Uh, LJ, you are a master at this now. This is called Buddies. And you put your tag on it so that we can just put that 
name on there when we sell these. This one is called Fu Furry Fun. <clears throat> Furry Fun. And this, <clears throat> excuse me, this is Magic's fur. Oh my gosh. Furry Fun. And that's Magic. Oh my gosh. LJ, you are phenomenal. These are just beautiful. And these are from our, our peacocks here out on the farmyard. Yep. This one, this is from Phoebe, and it's called Feathers. Oh, that's Phoebe fur. <laughs> that's adorable. Oh, I'm sorry, Barb. Barb, er, Barb, Barb, you are amazing. LJ, you are amazing. So are you, Pat. Oh. <laughs> Isn't this awesome? Wow. You don't remember? No. And this one is called So Fluffy. Look at that. I, you know, LJ, this must be kind of fun to do. To I, I see you make the cat's uh, silhouette there look so fun, and the the all of it, you know, it all goes together so nicely. I would try to do a stick and it would look like I don't know what. The stick would look like a stick? It wouldn't it even look like that. Oh, this is extra special. This is Jones's fur. Oh. This is called Kitty Love, but it's Jonesy, Jones's fur. Look at the tails. Uh-huh. This is really, really cool. And I, these are also peacock feathers. Oh my gosh, look. The, these are the top notch, what comes off of the oh. top of the head. Yeah. Those are from, that's from their, their top. Those little head piece things. Yeah. That is absolutely gorgeous. And not only because it's, I mean, it's beautiful, but Jones is such an awesome cat. Mm -hmm. um, here's a special one. Oh, gosh, I love all these. I want. This is called, oh, this is called I Want. And it's Coral Lee. Oh, reaching for the feathers. Wow, that's Coralie's fur. And Coralie, bless her heart, has a tail there. That is really wonderful. I think that's adorable. Oh my gosh. Bless you. This is totally different than any of the other ones. This is called Do I Hear Snackers? <laughs> Do I Hear Snackers? Um, LJ, this is phenomenal. That's Vern. Yeah, that's how Coralie imagines herself. Yep, I love that. That is Vern. You better not damage that or we're going to have more. Wow, that I that is that. really really cool. And then last but not least, this is a really 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 special one. And these feathers are still from the the farmyard. This is our special boy. It says, "Go for it." This is trucker trucker fur. Isn't that cool? So. These will eventually be up at a uh, flash sale, folks. Wow. Um, gee whiz. LJ, I can't even express my gratitude enough to you. You're, these are just phenomenal. These are really, really, really beautiful. Just think, that's from our kitties. Um, the lady that, that was here today, Angie and Jackie P., uh, Jackie P. has been working a lot today, brushing out all the outside kitties. And 
um, so you'll be getting that too. Now they're not marked though individually, but we the pack the package that we have now for you, LJ, has some individual cats names on the packages. Yeah, but we keep working on it. Come on, honey. Oh, and you know what, LJ? I've been when I go, oh, maybe a couple times a week. I've been combing uh, Shambhali. I've been making a Shambhali uh, plastic bag. Yeah. The last cat was Trucker. Yeah. They're really, really nice. LJ, thank you from the bottom of my heart for these. These are. They're splendid. They're, they are splendid. These are uh, part of us. This is. I extra love this one, that Jones one. They must be fun, hard to do, but fun to do. Wow. Is that a smaller box? I think I'll put them in that smaller box over there. That'd be easier, wouldn't it? Yeah. Well, that's a nice sturdy box for keeping. Yeah. You know, uh, Lynette might want this for packing. Whoops, now you guys do not any of you fall. They're still cold, yes. All right. <laughs> Miss, you're too funny. I would have to be picking out in a little bitty bitty. <laughs> Miss says we need fur from the bees. Okay, now we got our envelopes. I know I've had my tape. <laughs> I don't know where it's all gotten to. You know what? I think I'm going to sit on this side so I can hand them to the batter. Can that be politer? More polite? And the kitties have had, well, the two kitties have had their beds tonight. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I was at TSC yesterday, and uh, we were checking out. We were at the end of checking out, and my phone starts ringing, and there's a bunch of people there, and they're all looking around, and you know, looking around, and the cat I meow. Yeah, <laughs> and I just, I just didn't even respond. I just walked, you know, carried, got my packages, and walked on out. <laughs> And I kind of just kind of glanced over my shoulder, and they were still. What was that? That it was a cat. And it was so funny. So they might be still looking for a cat. I don't know. Um, this is from Elaine and Alan, who was is was the owner of Little Cat in Florida. Oh, Merry Christmas. Oh, and I'll take this box over. Oh, thank you. <laughs> It says in a happy new year in memory of little cat and delight and this is for our dryer fund. Hi Jackie. How dry I am. Go for it. 
Thanks, Elaine. Thank you, Alan. Appreciate this. Yeah, this will go definitely go in our our dryer fund. I thank you. We're go, we're gonna go for it. That's for sure. Sophie and Lucy's dad. Wonderful. A whole bunch of uh, coupons. I was asked today if we had any lately. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Pat. This is from Ellen P. from Iowa. Ellen P. Thank you. Cozy picture with a kitty on the front. May your home be filled with warmth and happiness during the holidays and all through the year. Merry Christmas to all humans, humans and cats. And this is E.H. Power. Thank you, Ellen. E.H. Power. Appreciate that. That looks like a very peaceful scene. This is from um, MJ. And it's not our mudgy MJ. It's a different one. Because um, I asked her one time. We got some more coupons with a kitty sticker on the front. Thank you. Uh oh, I might have done that wrong. Cammy, this is for Cammy and Janie. Uh oh. I think. And this is from EH Power. With a doggy on the front. Yeah, it's going to be a couple weeks yet. Aw, Merry Christmas, Cammy and Janie. May Santa Paws bring you something cool for you to enjoy. Ellen P., who is at EH Power. Thank you, Ellen. That's very nice. Cammy and Janie. They're very, very, very good doggies. And this came from Defiant. Oh, <laughs> Cute. <laughs> yeah, the rat saying, where's my cheese? Isn't that cute? A kitty paw. Paws. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. Oh, this is Buddy R. Buddy R. And Buddy R sent. <laughs> that is cute. <laughs> That's, I believe, one of our kitties. Um, cheap takes and a donation for the rescue center. Thank you for the cheap takes. Yeah. Oh, that's cute. I like that. Sanya! This is from Sanya. You okay, babe? This is for Jackie and the volunteers. So this is what you all call. Oh man, look at that. That is beautiful. Hope the holidays bring you everything you're dreaming of. Wishing a very Merry Christmas to um, the gang at FFRC, Sonia. Thank you, Sonia. That's beautiful. I'll give Vernie a big old Ooh, she sparkles from and everything. Yeah, sparkles, sparkly. This is from Judy, Judy R. from Florida. Judy R. And we have more. This is coupon day. Um, Judy R. from Florida. And um, there's a donation to the Rescue Center. And some coupons. Judy, thank you. Appreciate your help. Roger, spelled R-O-D-G-E-R, and Marjorie M. from uh, Napoleon, Ohio. Oh, so the, yeah, this is from Roger. And, well, that's very nice. Thank you, Roger. Thank you, I appreciate it. And he's from Napoleon. Thank you, Roger. Um, this is 
from Cat Lover 14 for so Cat Lover just want to let you know that your um, check came for the fundraiser. Thank you. is from out of the country. Here's a little kitty client. No, but my hair is poor. Why did you hear that? It says, can I have some help decorating the Christmas tree? This is from our Dibbly Dibbly Do from the UK, UK, isn't it? I think UK. To Jackie and the Pussycats, Happy Christmas, Merry Christmas, love ya, Dibbly Dibbly Do, Dibbly Thank You, beautiful. And this is from our friend in New Jersey, Tom P. Tom P. I'd like to wish you a Merry Christmas. Yeah, the DDD, -D -D, doubly do. Oh my gosh, oh, that surprised me. <laughs> oh, 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 it's the kitty wrapped up the line. <laughs> <laughs> that fun? Did you say that? <laughs> Best wishes to you, family, and all at the rescue center. Merry Christmas, Tom P. Thank that you, Tom. <laughs> I know I didn't laugh, but that was funny. <laughs> oh gosh, here's another one too. <laughs> this is also from Tom. Tom, you found some cool cards, I think. Oh. Mary card pull out. <laughs> I had to do that to get the tape. Oh, yeah, out. right. Aww. And then there's a kitty and it says open. Oh, open that way. Oh, what fun it is to wish you a very Merry Christmas. Buddy and Ashley P. Buddy and Ashley P. Isn't that cute? Tom, Buddy, and Ashley. Thank you. Look at those eyes sticking up. That's cute. I'm bad on those. I, I, I get a kick out of those. Mike and Gwen R. from Florida. Mike and Gwen R. You can use the window there, too. I want to put where these. people have... You know, are likely to yeah. play with it. Yes, yeah, yeah. Mike and Gwen are from Florida. Ooh, sparkles too. To everyone at FFRC, thank you so much for all that you do. Oh, without you, the center wouldn't be. Our volunteers are super duper good. Have a wonderful Christmas and a safe New Year. Blessings, Mike and G. And uh, this is Patchy's mommy. Um, oh, give your mom our best for Merry Christmas. Thank you. A Christmas remembering family and friends who are like family. Remembering special people like you. Merry Christmas. Mike, Gwen, and our precious kitties, Patches and Angel. And um, Mudgy, there's a donation here too. And this is for the dryer and the gas line fund. Thank you. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. This is from Joy D. from New York. Joy D. Oh. All the wild animals. It says, Christmas blessings to our FFRC family. May the light of Christmas shine in our hearts through all the new year. We so enjoyed watching Kitty Christmas. 
Dan hooked our computer to our big screen TV and enjoyed it in full screen bliss. <laughs> we laughed so at the visitors at the end. Lovingly, Don and Joy D. And uh, is it, oh, Cam, Camu? I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. Scotchy, Stitches, Abby, Ziva are their fur babies. Um, so thank you, Dan, Don, Don and Joy. Don and Joy, thank you. What, and what are you doing? What What is it? Made that leap from the counter. I know. That is a, Isn't she awesome? She quite a broad a, jump. Another spot on. Oh, no, that's where that other one was. Okay, honey. What? Closer? Yeah, did you need me for something? No. Okay, I'm going out to Mom's one as soon as I'm done. Yep, yep. This is from Margo F. Margo? Hey, we'll patch. Mewy Christmas. Yeah, the hoops and the yo-yos. <laughs> oh. Margo F. and Gabby. And Gabby, hope your holiday is simply perfect. Thanks for another great year. Thanks for all you do. And Mudgy, there's a donation from from Margo. Thank you, Margo. This uh, rescue center is very blessed with so many many of you out there. Uh oh. Um, I think we don't have a name on the outside. It got ripped. Oh. Hey, I recognize that cat. That's what Savon wanted to do this year. <laughs> Hope a happy holiday season is right in front of you. Oh, this is from Medina. M-E-D-I-N-A. Medina. Oh, oh, wait. I'm sorry. I did that wrong. Sorry. From Medina. Thank you for all you do for the kitties. Webcam viewer from Medina. So, so Mudgy, this is from a webcam viewer from Medina. And there's a gift card from Walmart. I thank you, a webcam friend from Medina, Ohio, uh, for your card and your Walmart card. Um, we, there's some things that we get at Walmart that is cheaper to get there than at other stores. Thank you. And this came from Indiana. And what are you doing? Just visit me. Just visit in. Oh, this is for a cookbook order. Okay. So let me get a pen. We are down to, I think, six cookbooks. Seven. Seven cookbooks now. I so didn't quite really hard to take mine home. Uh, did you get it off the pile yet? Oh, you got had it there. Okay, super. Well, I watched you walk out of the storeroom where I had it in the corner. So I have two minutes. That's yours. Can I give you this to put under Lynette's plastic? Okay, we'll get that. We'll get that for you. May I see that real quick again? There's one name that I've been looking for. Oops. Uh oh. Okay, I see now. Yeah, we'll have to keep. Okay, we're good. Cindy, we will get this out to you tomorrow. Now, it's a new little kitty cat. This is from Diana C. from Ohio. Diana C. from Ohio. It's so nice to recognize all these names. This is a Thomas Kincaid card. What are you doing? Here's a donation for your outside cats for whatever they may need. Diana C. from Ohio. And Mudgy, there is a donation specifically for the outside cats. Um, 
I am working on something for the outside kitty, so that will help me. Thank you. Peace to your home, joy to your heart, a very Merry Christmas to you, Diana C. Thank you. Well, who is this little itty? Alright, we got to do the tail thing. This is Hoover. And Hoover, you got a big day Saturday. Already make weight? Yeah, oh yeah, he's three. Really? Yeah, him's a big boy. This is from Melissa L. <laughs> I couldn't get the L almost stopped. I was going to say the whole name. <laughs> ah, yeah, that one's Hoover. Um, Melissa L. from New York. And thank you, Melissa, for your donation. <coughs> uh, this is from Rita, Johnny, and Sparky in Wisconsin. Oh, created just for you by Rita. Johnny, Sparky, brothers Lenny and Squiggy, Yancey and Trisha. And this is from Rita and the Kitties. Um, oh, in memory of your mom, Granny H. Wishing you blessings at Christmas and always. So here, there's the kitties. Um, Sparky, Lenny, Squiggy, Trisha, Yancey, and Johnny. That's a great picture. And uh, here's a picture of you. Thank you, Rita, and your kitties. <coughs> this is from Dennis. Dennis is a volunteer. He used to work here a lot, help me out a lot, and then he's got a full-time job now, which is nice. He's adopted a few cats from us, and he still comes out. He still considers the Colby cats his, and he'll come out and visit <coughs> them. You're right. No, I don't know, guys. Basil. Little cat fur. <coughs> Wise men still seek him. Be our hearts seek him, our hands serve him, our feet follow him. Christmas blessings, Dennis. And here's his cats: Casper, Reddick, Leo, Driscoll, and Pita. And I know Driscoll is ours. It seems like. Casper is also ours, I believe, but I know Driscoll. Driscoll is too. Casper, totally no, ignoring you. Kitties are kitty play is more important. So are they those two okay together? Yeah, because I picked them up and you went right back. I don't hear anybody squeaking unless he can't. <laughs> no, he's okay. <laughs> oh, Barb, that's a real shy gray one. We should get him and hold him. So this is from Jane H. from Paulding, right next door. Jane H. Joy to your you and yours. <coughs> Night will patch. Warm wishes for a Merry Christmas. Very Merry Christmas and the happiest of New Year's. Bless you for all you do. Jane H. And Mudgy, there's a donation from Jane and uh, Jane, I appreciate it very much. Oops. Wrong way. Wrong way. Isn't that pretty? Oh, my. Oh, this. Oh, Craig. Da da da. You asked me to let you know. This is for. This is Daisy's dad. Oh, this is Daisy's dad. Daisy's daddy. And. This, yeah, Craig, this was for the um, fundraiser, so it did, your check did arrive. Thank you. You know what's kind of cool is all the people that tell me before we have a fundraiser or during the fundraiser that they would like so-and-so um, tickets, um, and they would send a check. Every one of them has always honored that. They've that always, amazing. we have never... Or, and we have never 
uh, we have never gotten a bad check from FFRC for FFRC. I did occasionally for um, Earth Angels when we had our spay neuter clinic, but not. I could probably count on one hand all the years that we did that. So hey, did you do the drawing for the volunteer the things? That I was supposed to do that today. I gotta write it down. Hey, Mudgy. <laughs> Mudgy, on your paper, will you write, remember volunteer drawing? And I will do that tomorrow. I got the paper on my desk to cut up and do. So, because uh, we have those two items from the fundraiser to do for the volunteers. So, Mudgy, if you would do that, I'd appreciate it. This is from Neil and Jill W. from Sherwood, Ohio. Another neighboring, very close. Right, well, they're Defiance County. Wishing everyone at your home a world of happy things, beginning with the special joy that Christmas always brings. Merry Christmas. And this is Yanil and Jill W. And oh, oh, I remember this. <laughs> well, they, they're the ones who adopted Piper. We adopted Piper the end of October in 2008. How could that be that long ago? She was rescued from a drain pipe in Como, Mississippi, and flown to you. Piper. Mm -hmm. oh Do you remember gosh. that? No, that was before my time. Oh, yeah. She was rescued from a drain pipe in Como, Mississippi, and so. flown to you. That's how she got her name, Piper. We wanted up to update you that she is doing well and is loved. The calico in the one photo was thrown on the road in front of our house when she was about six weeks old. We brought the kitten in, and Piper immediately started acting like her adopted mommy to Zoe. She bathed her and disciplined her when needed. They both are very close and a little spoiled. Piper wanted to make a small donation to help another kitty like you helped her find her forever home. Please use this where it is needed. And Mudgy, there was, there was a donation in there. Merry Christmas, Jill, Piper, and Zoe Wonder, Zoe, and, um, oh, so, uh, the calico and the one was thrown, so the calico, yeah, here's calico, that's Zoe, and here's Piper, wow, 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 done growed, oh, look, I love these curly Q pictures when they curl up and sleep. That's Piper. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. So, 
I think that will, no, we have one more. And I'm not sure if being a daisy's on. <clears throat> you told me to look for an envelope from the UBS. And I think this is it. <clears throat> the flying envelope. You know, we're missing one envelope. Now that I'm thinking about it. Well, I I think so. I'll flip through these real quick for me. I think you can put I think there was one because I recognized a name that I didn't say tonight. I got the one that was the Can I give you that one? Okay. This is Trey. Just if, do you want to just flip through Oh, there? I'd love to see if there's any cards. There. And yeah. Pina Daisy, this is this is from Pina Daisy. And oh, I thank you so much. Thank you, Daisy June. Thank you. You guys are all so very kind and generous and helpful to us. And um, just in case anyone is still wondering about that washer. Yep, no. Am I looking for a check? A check. Uh, okay. Yeah, it was one of those that you have to tear across and around. Okay, I don't remember seeing one like okay. that. No, Pilby. Uh, June, thank you. I'll send you a car, uh, a note to. Um, but just in case you're wondering, we are definitely going ahead with the dryer. Um, Steve and I was talking about it, and it's silly to. We we're so close. I mean, we're we're like only. I don't know. I think it was like twelve hundred away. That's not very much compared to the total cost and it was silly to hold up on the washer the dryer when they have to come and it takes a it'll be a whole day of installations for the two um, like the the dryer vent instead of being the four inch it'll be an eight inch vent they have to do that um, there's just a oh they have to drill into the cement floor the washer is actually anchored into our floor so there's a lot that they have to do and we just want to do it in one day instead of messing with two days and we were close enough and with the, with the Christmas donations we're going to be able to do that um, we also have something else up our sleeve that I've been hinting around about but we it's taking us a much much longer to get it finished than what we had anticipated Pat, I only got four done in an hour. Wow. So I got faster as I went. But. Wow. Pat has helped us a lot. Lynette has done lots of work on it. I don't know if you have all have seen Marsha that comes in. She's been helping us in the mail room in Palmart, and she's helped an awful lot, too, to help put these together. Um, oops. I, well, yeah. I don't want to give you too many hints. <laughs> 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 yeah. yeah, don't want to give too many hints, but it's really awesome, and you guys are really, really going to like it, I think. I think. So I better just be quiet, because I tend to talk too much. Yeah, we have a new kitty. So this new kitty does not have a name yet. There, We had a volunteer here that used to work here a while ago, and she, we still love her. She's such a great person. Her name is Judy E. That's when we had... I think four Judy's here. So she was Judy E. And she called me this morning. Her and her husband still come and visit sometimes. And she called this morning and said that she found a kitty that was outside her door. Just I guess she was meowing. This cold morning. I know. Oh. And this kitty was a wreck. Um, not only was she filthy, filthy, dirty, uh, she has lice. Lice is no big deal. We can get rid of that real easy and already have. Um, she had a few fleas on her. Uh, she is so thin and she was so thirsty. It amazes me when, hey that's rude on the cam. It's, it amazes me <clears throat> how thirsty some of these cats can be and they'll drink 
a couple bowls of water. It's amazing. And you could tell she was dehydrated, you know, how you pull up their fur and it just stays tent, tented up. So, um, and she was so famished. She was so hungry and thin. And she's three-legged. Hey. Three-legged. Vernon's going to need, I think, assistance. Uh-huh. I think he's going to, is he going to be grouchy? I better do it It's all right. It's all right, baby. And it's a, she's a three-legger. It's black because she's black and white. Yes, yes, Nance. And, um, but I, and I do not think she was born this way. I think this was a injury. And I do think somebody had her, um, taken her to a vet for proper surgery. You know, sometimes people just leave them go, and if they are lucky enough not to get maggots and stuff in them or grand infections, you know, uh, it just depends on how they heal. But anyhow, this looks like it was surgically repaired, and it's on her, I, whichever side, I think it's her right leg missing. Um, the right bottom thing is also missing. But I think she's an older cat. Her eyes look really what's called moth-eaten, the pupils. And so I'll have Dr. Darcy, of course, give her a physical on Saturday and check her age for us, too. But she's so nice. She was so dirty. It was scrub up, rinse off, scrub up, rinse off. Her water, her first go-around was filthy. It was just dirty. So she's not the fastest of condition. Uh, you can tell she's been scrounging for a while by herself. But my goodness, she's such a baby. She's such a really nice kitty. So let me go get her for you. Don't have her name yet. She does also have a little upper respiratory, so I'm going to scoop Sarah over. So she's going to get a name pretty soon, and um, she still looks pretty messy. She's Her white is not white, and she's just, this all just needs brushed out and thin. What's that a funny sound, what isn't is it? What is she doing, huh? But, um, gosh, the first thing she wanted was water. Lots and lots and lots of water. And uh, then she ate, I, I never give a whole can right away of food, the small ones. And she ate a whole half down. I mean, I gave it to her, went back to the sink, and went back, I mean, like, what, four steps to talk to her. And the food was gone. It was literally, she inhaled it. So we waited about 10 minutes and gave her the other half of the bottle, or uh, other half of the can. And isn't she pretty? 
She's really good. I love her nose. Huh? You like Jackie Horne nails. She says, I do like attention. So it's her right right front leg that's missing. Yeah. But it's just nice that it's peeled and mm -hmm. all that over. Yeah. So she's got, she needs ears. Her ears still clean. Major, major uh, parasite control. And we've got the lice are dead. Now we just have to, you know, how we have to brush and brush and get the nits off. But the nits are dead also. And um, we've got her on antibiotics, so we'll get control of that um, upper respiratory infection. The empty belly and the dryness we can take care of just by food and water. She'll get her physical on Saturday. She does walk okay, yep. Isn't it amazing how they how they learn to do that? Yeah, I love her little mustache. Yeah. <laughs> Peanuts is doing absolutely beautiful. He's doing really, really well today. And he's been he's been up walking a little bit, but he's he's kept it under control without uh, cause he I don't want him to overdo it. And uh, he's he's been being real oh, I was afraid of that. Can you give me a, a wet one? Wet one. I just don't want her to sneeze on anybody. You mean the baby wipe? Yeah, I just want to wipe her nose. Yeah, try to block her sneeze. Thank you. I thought I could feel a sneeze over working. She says I'm sorry, but I didn't sneeze on anybody. Yeah. So she just needs some good old TLC and. Some loving and just a place to call home for a while, huh? You are cute. Yeah, so Peanuts is doing really well. And she'll get her physical. Um, I shaved her tummy. It does not appear to have... <laughs> to have a, a spay line. So when she gets better, we'll get that taken care of. Yeah. Alright, you ready to go back? I got a feeling she's going to sleep all night. Yeah, she's a good girl. All right, let's wipe your nose one more time. And you all are probably aware we got a little, little thing going on with some of our kittens. There's a couple of them with a, just a little bit of um, eye goo and a little bit of runny nose. It's really minor. I've got all of them on antibiotics, and um, they're they're acting fine, and they're eating and playing. I just want to make sure that they're all the way better, so that we can do their surgeries on on uh, oops, on Saturday. There, sorry, gosh, that moved. So I wiped it today, and it does. I know what you're saying, Evil. It does. It has like it looks like a little foggy, doesn't it? Yeah. All right, you ready? Okay. Thanks for sending your love to her and for gonna love her from afar, huh? Yeah. You are gonna have some fun in here. I promise you. When you get better, you're gonna just be rocking and rolling with the rest of them. She sure's got a pretty face, doesn't she? All right. Well, let me just <coughs> excuse me. Let me just show you the tree one more time, and then I'll come back and lower it. <coughs> These are off badge portable. Now, but I didn't see one of the tear strips when you handed them.